we can make front panel objects transparent which allows us to layer multiple controls and indicators so that they appear in the same place when a user selects a particular option. Transparency affects only the appearance of an object. The object responds to mouse and key operations as usual. We cannot change the color of system controls because the system controls change appearance depending on which platform we run the VI. These controls appear in the colors we have set up for our system. To make an object transparent we can use the coloring tool to right click an object to display the color picker if automatic tool selection is enabled when we select coloring tool from the tools palette automatic tool selection becomes disabled another way to access the tools palette is to hold down shift key and then right click this displays a temporary version of tools palette at the location of the cursor and goes away whenever we click anywhere else on the front panel or block diagram. We can select the T box in the upper right corner of the color picker. We can also make parts of a front panel object transparent, including borders. To make the border of an object transparent, for example, if we have a string control, so we can use the coloring tool to right click the border of an object to display the color picker. Now if the automatic tool selection is enabled, selecting the coloring tool will disable the automatic tool selection. So we can press the F key for foreground and select the box in the upper right corner of the color picker. LabVIEW makes the control border transparent. The background color of the front panel or the object containing the control determines the color of the control border. So this is the control border and 
the color of the front panel determines what colors it acquires it changes with the color of the background color of the front panel 